Hi, it's Rachel from UWorld. Today we're going to be discussing an interview question on clinical error management. So let's get started. So you may be asked a question like, tell us about a time that you made a clinical error. How was it resolved? You also could be asked something like, describe a mistake you made in a clinical setting and how you handled it. So it's really important to show that you understand why these errors matter and how it's made you a smarter and safer nurse. In your response, you wanna utilize a specific clinical situation that you were directly a part of. You don't wanna use a story that you've heard from a peer or an instructor, and you don't wanna talk about an error that you've made that was egregious or super severe. You don't wanna portray yourself poorly. So as a new nurse, your clinical experiences might be limited, and your interviewers know this, so lab simulations are totally fine to use as an example. So you want to clearly state what the error was. Doing so is going to help set up the rest of the story for a successful end. So you want to demonstrate an understanding of why this error happened and also describe how you'll prevent it in the future. And then you want to explain what you learned from it. You being able to learn from mistakes and then being able to prevent them in the future demonstrates that you understand the importance of patient safety, which is absolutely critical for nurses. Overall, you wanna show that you're coachable, motivated to correct your mistakes, and able to learn quickly from past experiences. So let's talk about an example of how you'd answer this question. One thing you could mention is breaking sterile field. You can talk about how you broke sterile field and Yes, while that was an error, you caught it before moving on with the procedure at hand. You would wrap up the conclusion by explaining what you learned, how you utilize resources like another nurse to help you correct the error, and then how you successfully completed the clinical task. So this wraps up our video on clinical errors. We hope you enjoyed it and subscribe for more of our content.